Hi guys, I'm Tim O'Connor and this is my 1982 Toyota Hilux, currently for sale on Trade Me with a $1 reserve. I've fitted the custom stripes, they're a 3M metallic wrap vinyl, so they give the extra bounce, you've got the nice sunlight reflecting off them at the moment, matches the metallic blue. The metallic blue is derived from a Toyota RAV4 colour, slightly altered with a little more pearlescent in it. Down here we can see the Wheels fitted are a 17 inch Mickey Thompson with a 33 inch Black Lion mud tyre. Still got a lot of nice tread left on there. Down here we can see the sills are in excellent condition. All original spot welds along here. And the doors and the front guards are all reproduction items. So there's guaranteed no rust in those. Now the tray on this vehicle is originally off a two wheel drive ute came off a fruit orchard, only used for carrying hay bales, so there's very few dents in it, if any. On the tailgate we can see the Toyota and the extra badging has been custom made. This is a pearlescent vinyl. And down low we've got the custom made tow bar with a tow hook there. The flares on this tray have been custom made from steel. They've been cut from front guards and actually welded in smooth to be a perfect fit so you'd never actually know these weren't factory but originally these did have a plastic clip-on guard the aluminium roll bar on this is off a of holden colorado slightly altered to fit and we've got the crump edition badging on there toyota yellow spotlights i believe those are off an old land cruiser they fit the vibe of the vehicle perfectly in the cabin We'll see the door cards have been retrimmed. All the door rubbers are all new. Got new glass rubbers fitted in here with, and the windows are tinted. Looking inside, we've got all new trim, new hood lining, new carpet, and a original old school wood rim steering wheel. New pedal rubbers fitted, along with new carpet as well. We've got a five-speed gearbox here, that's the R151F from the Toyota Prado. And here's the four-wheel drive manual selector. This isn't required if you're using the electric switch and the locking front hubs. Now remember, this vehicle hasn't got the correct front diff ratio, so the four-wheel drive can't be used. So we're going to start this beast up. Obviously running the Lexus 1UZ FE V8. Uh, this has also been fitted with a custom made Gilmer belt, so it makes a nice whine and we've got a pretty decent exhaust note out the back as you'll see soon. So it fires straight up. You can hear the Bluetooth connect, so by the way it has got a hidden Bluetooth audio system which you can connect your phone. We've got a 50 watt amp under the dash here and in behind the seat we've also got a subwoofer just sneaked in there. One of the best features in here is the openable centre back window. Alright let's check out the engine bay. So this is the 1UZ FE, it's a 4 litre quad cam Lexus V8 from a Lexus LS400. We've got an aluminium radiator, electric thermo fans. It's got a pod filter with a custom intake pipe. Down here we can see the Gilmer pulleys. These have been custom machined from aluminium. LVV certification plate, stating all of the modifications. Underneath we can see it's fitted with Monroe gas shocks. And over this side, we've got the aftermarket drop-down steering arm to suit the two-inch lift. Under here, we can see the rear end has been disc brake converted. These are Toyota Corolla units. And up under here, we can see the three-inch exhaust as well. Okay, let's take this beast for a drive. 